Hello and welcome to Two Minute Mods with Tiny Pirate. Today we're talking about mods for Kerbal Space Program. Now you may be thinking that the simplest way to get mods for Kerbal Space Program, because let's start at the beginning with how you find them, is to go to curse.com, the official mod website, and browse the mods there. However, this is not the case. The other option is to go to the Kerbal Forums. The add-on section has a lot of information on mods and development and mods that are released. But this is also not the best way to get mods. The simplest way to get mods is to use the Comprehensive Kerbal Archive Network mod, available from the link in the video description. Once you've got to the mod GitHub site, simply click the ccan.exe link, download it, drop it on your desktop somewhere, and away you go. The exe file is compatible with Windows, Mac and Linux, and all you have to do to use it is open it, find your copy of Kerbal Space Program, and then click select, and tick the box. Once CCAN opens, you may need to hit refresh to get the current list of available mods, and once you have the mod list down, simply tick the mods you want to use, click go to changes, Click Apply. Your mods will now be downloaded and installed, and with a simple click of Run Kerbal Space Program, the game will launch for you. The great thing about CCAN is that it lets you check what mods are currently available, it updates your mods for you, and allows you to easy uninstall mods. It even handles dependencies, so mods which require other mods, it will install those for you as well. So before you get into using mods in Kerbal Space Program, go grab CCAN. Browse for mods of interest and start installing them. Check the rest of this series for more mods that you may like to use. If you enjoyed this video, please like, subscribe, and drop us a comment.